Welcome everyone to tabinfo.com and today we are going to talk about set versus rank but then who am I? Do subscribe to my channel if you have not already subscribed. Don't miss to hit the bell icon. Set versus rank. Today we are going to talk about top and bottom end using set top and bottom and using rank which way is better to use rank within category how to down download the rank workbook i will simply give you a link top and idea at forum that i would like to share with you so before moving further i think the best way to learn is to do yourself so let us try to do step by step so first of all uh, I have one lookup table that will help you to understand the data. So this is the state versus sum of sales. And after that, I'll jump over to a brand new sheet from where I can just drag and drop sum of sales plus state. I can just uh, sort this in a descending order. Now, I would like first to make use of set. So I will create a set on what? On state, right? So I would search for the state and I would say a set top. I have the option to create a new parameter over there, but then I already have a parameter. So I would not make use of this. And instead of that, I would say n states, which is a parameter already developed by me. Fair enough. So I would say demo class top five so that you won't get confused with the other set over there. Demo class top five. Maybe I can filter on demo. So it's better to filter like this. So I get my top five. Simple enough. Now I'll show you how to create bottom five. You don't you will only have to flip top to bottom over there, and your job is done. So now I already have a bottom end set over there, so I'm not going to make it again, but then I'll show you how it works. I'll remove the top one and here are the bottom one. As you know, I already talked about uh, the lookup table. So here is the lookup table. So you can come back and you can check the bottom five states over there and it matches. Yeah, it matches. Now we have seen top five, we have seen top n and we have seen bottom n. Now we should see combination of top end and bottom end. So what I'll do is I'll just create a combined set. Again, I'll say demo class top and bottom. So I'm trying to combine both and I should see top 5 and bottom 5. Fair enough. You can always uh, analyze for face by dragging to colors that you can do any line. Or maybe you have sales over there and you can analyze for profit that can give you a different picture where you can see that okay maybe these are giving sales but at the expense of profit, profit is minus. So you would like to, to see that part as well, sale versus profit. Anyways, we have completed the top five, bottom five, top n, bottom n, and top and bottom n both. So now we should know how we can do that with the help of rank. So if I just remove everything, 
and uh, yeah eliminate everything say rank i'll create rank on state not state but i have to create rank rank on some of So we have demo class rank and I would say demo class rank and you can see I need to turn that to discrete fair enough so if I create a calculation out of that on demo class rank and if I want to have So if you remember, we had that top end parameter already over there. So if we'd like to relate this one to that, I would say demo class. So here I'm trying to show you with the help of rank. So if I want to have top n, I would say, okay, my rank should be less than or equal to this parameter that's fine that means demo class rank okay <laughs> enough should not have that space over there demo class rank so this will be for top n because it's simply demo class rank which is this less than equal to this so if i change that you know, let me show you first this is true so if it is there are 5 19 34 fair enough but if I want to have the same scenario as we had sorry demo class rank top n if I want to have the same scenario like top and bottom and so what should I do I'll have to make use of size now what is size size returns the number of rows in the partition so it will return total number of rows but why i'm doing like this the the logic is either the rank should be less than or equal to parameter that is 10 for now but at the same time if i want to have bottom 12 i'll have to do like this my rank is less than or equal to this and my rank is greater than equal to size minus again and states so here i would say top n and bottom n that means 7 so if you still remember my funda over there less than 7 less than equal to 7 so these top 7 and after that if you see the total number of rows are 49 so maybe rather i would say that my rank should be greater than 49 minus 7 fair enough and i get my top 7 and bottom 7 both so i've used both calculation and set and I've shown you how to make use of uh, those utilities uh, in order to create top and and bottom and and top and bottom for the scenarios. But when to use what? Look, here is the showdown set will give you better performance. So when you are working with big data, you would always like to make use of set rather than making use of any calculation. So you avoid calculation. You want to analyze 
uh, there is no other option you make use of calculation you must be sounding i must be sounding funny that you know most of the people who are just starting with this sample superstore that you know calculation is everything but then if you have anything that would allow you to avoid calculation we do that because rank sorry calculation is not very very performance oriented set is higher up the order that you can see on the right hand side uh, extract filter data source context filter so it is hitting the data source first calculation is a data is coming to calculation later on so that is the other difference but then rank is more flexible up till now we have seen the top and bottom but we have not seen the rank within a category so that is a problem and that is being addressed with the help of rank because it has got the power of addressing and partitioning this is possible with rank but not with the set so i would go with set if i just want to if you if i have a single dimension over there but when it comes to a new dimension coming to my view for example region then it will break my calculation if i want uh, top end within my region then what to do now set will not help me but rank will help me so here you can see it's so easy for me with the help of uh, rank that i can uh, rank within a category within a region by bringing a new dimension to my view so here i can you can see both way you can do like that only so you have to restart so that is the power rank is having but this is not with uh, set so that's why i said it is more flexible now i can have top and and bottom and within this within region that is not possible with set so there are advantages disadvantages and you will make use of set and rank but when you you don't have such scenarios where you have to bring in more dimensions and adding more dimension to your view go with set only otherwise you can go with rank when you have to do something like this although uh, i was talking about the last segment of my tutorial today top end idea at forum you can vote for that now i can show you so i'll make sure that i have that very particular link to my youtube description but then this idea is for you know top and bottom and filter work great when adding the filter on one dimension but what if i want to know the top and product for each region so if you want to avoid uh, this rank thing and uh, so that we can get more performance out of that so something you know so, so this is an idea which has been posted and 178 people have voted for that so i would uh, request you to vote as well so that we get a direct utility something like set which would help us to uh, create a rank within partitions without making use of uh, calculation that can um, that can affect the performance of my dashboard or your dashboard so i am uh, done for today uh, do subscribe to my channel uh, if you if my videos are making sense to you and uh, don't miss to hit the bell icon if you want to get regular updates uh, thanks and i'm signing off from tablet info for today see you soon bye bye take care